The Winter War of 1939 to 1940, also known as the Soviet Finnish War, saw the tiny Finnish army take on the might of the Soviet Union's gigantic Red Army. There was mistrust between the two countries. Finland believed the Soviet Union wanted to expand into its territory and the Soviet Union feared Finland would allow itself to be used as a base from which enemies could attack. Finland declared itself neutral at the start of the Second World War, but the Soviet Union demanded concessions. Finland delayed, using the time to mobilize its army and seek help from Sweden and the Western Allies, including Britain and France, but with little success. A faked border incident gave the Soviet Union the excuse to invade on 30 November 1939. The Red Army was ill-equipped, poorly led, and unable to deal with the Finnish terrain and winter weather. Though small and under-resourced, the Finnish army was resilient, well-led and was able to use knowledge of the terrain to good effect. Despite the overwhelming odds, Finland resisted for three months with little outside assistance. However, it was only a matter of time before the balance of power tipped in the Soviet Union's favor. The Red Army came back strongly. Their command structure was reorganized, modern equipment was brought in and there was a badly needed change of tactics and personnel. By early February 1940, the Finnish army was exhausted and their defensive lines eventually overrun. Outside help never materialized. Finland was forced to sign the Treaty of Moscow on 12 March 1940, which ceded 11% of its territory to the Soviet Union. 